So this is the all-new 2011 Chrysler 300, and we really have changed everything about the car. It's all-new sheet metal completely around the vehicle, and as you can see at the front of the vehicle here, we've added LED running lights, the Chrysler 7-slot liquid chrome grille. We've actually increased the glass by 15% for better outward visibility on the car. So the glass is taller, we've narrowed the pillars, and we've actually canted it back about three degrees so that the vehicle is more aerodynamic. We've got LED taillights on the back of the vehicle and a very subtle fin in the back corners, which is a little bit of an homage to one of the very early Chrysler 300 models that we built. So the interior of the Chrysler 300 is entirely new as well, and we've really gone to great lengths to improve the interior of the vehicle. And it starts with soft touch surfaces throughout the vehicle. Everywhere a consumer would touch soft touch surfaces. We've got, when you look at the interior, real wood accents on the steering wheel, on the dashboard, and on the doors. And then rich Napa leather, you can see an example of it here. In this case, we've got ventilated and heated front seats. We've got heated rear seats in the vehicle. And in the center of the dash, the 8.4 inch Uconnect touch screen from which a consumer can navigate their way around um, look at maps, again, all their music can be stored there, pictures can be stored there, hands-free telephone communication there as well, and just a gorgeous dash design on the vehicle. Now, some of the options that are available on the Chrysler 300 are the panoramic glass sunroof, so it really opens up the interior of the vehicle, brightens it up as well, and even to the extent in the back window, we actually have a sunshade that sits down in the rear of the vehicle, and with a flick of a button, it will pull up to provide shade to the the customers in the back row of the vehicle, put the vehicle into reverse and it automatically retracts, or of course it would retract when you hit the button and tell it to. So the other big story with the Chrysler 300 for 2011 are the all new powertrains that we've got in the vehicle. We've installed a 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine in the model, delivers 39 miles to the gallon, which is the same fuel economy you'd get from the smaller mid-size cars, but in a full-size luxury car. Then for the die-hard Hemi customer, you can still get the 5.7 liter Hemi, 363 horsepower, but with that you get 35 miles per gallon as well because it's got the multiple displacement system that will shut off four cylinders when needed so it goes to a four cylinder you've got all eight cylinders when you need those as well and when you get that 5.7 if you want to you can get an all-wheel drive system as well and that all-wheel drive system has an automatic disconnect for the front axle so that when conditions don't warrant all-wheel drive it seamlessly disconnects it nothing for the driver to do it just happens and provides better fuel economy for you